Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I am going to be doing a pen test of this mini jot gel pens. I've had this for a while, um, at least about a month, and I've been wanting to use them. They're so little that I figured since I am using this journal every day, why not try it in here? Oh, it would be nice to show you the journal. So I was like, why not try it in here? So we're going to do a pen test in here. I like to do pen tests on all kinds of papers that I'm going to be using. So whatever journal I'm using or whatever planner I'm using, I like to do pen tests to see what pens are good with it and what pens are not. I put this little sticker. Well, it's like a tab divider or whatever, and it's like so bending. I got to figure out how to get that better. Okay, so yeah, let's get into here, and you will see that I did a pen test in the back. These notebooks are pretty much the same. That's the same quality paper. The only thing different is this is blank, so it's no line, no dot, no grid, and then it's all the craft paper, uh, cardstock. It's like an ivory paper, and then this one is, this is my medication list. Um, dot grid, it doesn't matter if you see it. And then the next one, and again, same company, same paper. That's my April. And then the next one is line paper. So, exactly the same, like I said. So with this, I'm thinking of doing, like, every time I want to write in here and stuff, and I want to change color ink, this would be pretty cool to do because it has pretty much a lot of good colors. Purple, silver, blue, green, yellow, another, did I say purple? Black, I'm taking that back. Silver, blue, green, yellow, purple, another kind of purple, pink, and then I think it's two different reds or one is an orange. So with that being said, I want to tell everybody welcome, please subscribe. I don't know if I even said this. Please give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. So my intro was probably long. So I'm going to take it apart. And then if they do, like, write nice in here, and they are, by the way, glitter. So they are the glitter um, gel pens in sorted colors. And you get 10 of them for a dollar. I mean, the size is, like, not even, let's see. It's not even a hand. Like, it's not big at all. Let's get a regular pen. Um, do I even have regular pens anymore? Let's see. I have this llama. Okay. So we know this is like about a regular pen right here. Except for the tip. So this is how... Oh, I just lost the cap. This is how small it is without the cap on the llama. That's how small it is. It's very extremely small. Oh, let me grab that cap before I lose it. So that is the only thing that makes me a little bit leery of these pens. Because, I mean, look at how small your hand is. I mean, not your hand, but small this pen is. So that is what it looks like. With Delta Cap, does it say anything in particular? So it's made by Jot, assorted colors, and no. No point size, no nothing. Just a gel pen. Okay, so let's start off with, this is so weird to write. I have to have the cap on because I need more of the, like the hand, I guess. So we're going to write Jot. Can't tell if this is black or gray. And look at how cute this is. It's so it's got like glitter in it. You see it? Oh, is it so cute? So jot mini gel pens. Now I know this is not gonna bleed through. Or I hope. But it is like writing very nice. Let me show you. Okay, 
Let's see if I can show you the glow. Oh, there you go. Do you see that? Oh, it's so pretty. And it started right away. I like that. Um, we're going to do silver. I'm going to kind of like go out of order. Because I don't even know what order it was in anyway. So this is silver. God, this is so small. Okay, wrote right away. I don't know if you'll be able to see silver, so I'm going to hold it up. So again, silver. Or gray, it could be. Now the silver, you could barely see on this color paper. So unless you're trying to like... I hope I spelled that correctly. S-I-L-V-E-R. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just tired. Um, we're gonna do a blue. Yeah, we'll do a blue first. Blue is very pretty. Now, just to show you the quality of it. Okay, so this paper is not like the thickest paper. I mean, if you were to double up on paper, you hear it's not the thickest. But it's not like bleed through. Oh, well, maybe the black. But it does have shadowing. So depending on how heavy you write, I write heavy, so that's probably why you're getting like a little bit of bleed. But for a dollar and you get ten of them. Okay, usually I do not like green ink that looks like this because it's so like light. But on here, it is not. So I like that. Um, we'll go with yellow. Now yellow is another one of those colors. I love yellow ink. I love like I love yellow. I love green. I love orange. The thing with that is some of the colors, like I mentioned, does not show up very well. Yellow is one of those colors. I could rarely find a good yellow, not gold, but yellow, that will stand, you know, stand up to it. So we're going to go with purple. Now it looks like two different purples, so I'm going to see what color this writes and then just write a color. So that pretty much is a purple. I love filling my books up with pens, like just pen tests. Oh, so that one I do like. How's the purple and the bleed? I love the fact that they all start, you know, pretty relatively fast. I haven't had a problem. Knock on wood. Okay, so let's see what this color turns out to be. It's a purple, I think. So I'm just going to put light purple considering it's lighter than the other one. Let's bring it closer because I definitely need to see it. So it kind of started off a little bit dark like this one and then went into this color. If you can see that. And then we're going to go with the pink. So there's only one pink, and then it's red and orange. Ooh, pink is pretty. Pink has always been a pretty color. I don't know why this thing's closing. It's not a lay flat notebook, though. So that's probably why. Pink has got to be my favorite. Pink, um, the pink, the blue, definitely the black. If you know anything about how I like my pens, I like them black. But I do like to write in color, and I'll show you in a... <laughs> I literally wrote black. Let me fix that to red. And I don't care if you scribble in there. It's just a pen test. I mean, I do, because I don't like to have it like looking all crazy. But, you know. I made a mistake. Okay, so this is orange. And I like orange. But my favorite color is probably the pink and the black and the blue. And the green. I like them all. 
But that is my pen test. And then I'm going to show you. Just a dollar pen. And look at the page. Okay, let me have my hand focus it. There you go. The silver, I'm not a fan, and the yellow, I'm not a fan. But the other colors, even the black down here that says red, no, I, I like it. But the purple's cute, the green, the blue, the black, and definitely the pink. And then the back side, and again, this is not like the a favorite type of paper. Oh, yeah, it don't look too bad. It does have like a little bit of bleed, or a little dot of it. And so in here, I wrote, and I'll show you the colors, I wrote in black and pink. This is how I do, like, when I'm writing stuff out. And then, like, if I go here, I just write in black. Yeah, they're all black. And I'm not done with this one. I'm not done with today. But I wrote it in black. Black. The work schedule. Black. Which I'm actually going in tomorrow. So yeah, so if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment. Share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. As always, thank you for watching. And I hope you enjoy the pen test. And a little quick flip through of my journal. But this is, I think, one of my favorites. I'm actually using it. Which I rarely do. Like, I have goals in here. I have my dailies. And then I'll just keep going in here. See where it takes me. Oh, I have my medication list. So I already have things, like, tabbed out that I have to cut and make half. But, yeah, so thank you for watching. Oh, another thing. I used blue, which is not the normal for me. So, again, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Hit that plus. Test. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Give it a big thumbs up and I will talk to you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye bye.